because I need to use it. And I couldn't do it properly, so my hands slipped off. And I decided to want to come right back to where it was. Where my hand was still at. So I wanted to go smash my hand. If I didn't do my hand, it would have broke it. And on that note, hello everyone. Well, not just one of the friends. That's absolutely Well, yeah. Like, you ready, Connor? No, he's watching TikTok. Connor's taking a mental vibe right now, I think. Connor just woke up, everybody, just so you know. What is that? Oh, yeah. Um, but yeah, hello everybody, welcome to Sloth and Friends. D&D uh, &D is happening tonight, today. Is everyone excited? 100%. Okay. Um, also... Um, so, oh, hold on, hold on, I'm gonna make sure, make sure we have audio, we have audio, so I'm gonna... I know, so I'm checking to make sure we have audio. I I I reset I re I reset the camera. Let's turn it down. That was last week. I just reset the camera. I just did it. That was like last week. Fuck off. So somebody else do it. I can't do it right now. Yeah, no, the power. I don't so like last power. week. Slow bro. So last week we just didn't have audio for like the whole session. Don't and it, it. it just, you know, <laughs> bad feels all around. <laughs> but we did go watch fireworks, so it wasn't like the end of the world. Oh, what? The fireworks were fun. <laughs> Hi, Luke. Make sure you stay tuned. So. Oh, Luke's watching? Yeah, Luke, I'm, I'm being genuine. Don't look away. Um. <laughs> We'll get so, we'll thank you to tabletopaudio.com and then the World of Fantasy for offering these wonderful ambiances to us as a group and anyone else that wants to use them because they're free. Also, Mackie, I hope you're having fun on vacation. Now, last we left off, our adventurers were still on the ship and a surprise attack was launched by Tyr. So I managed to bore a hole through the top of the ship and get down to them. I mean, what wind did? I mean, <laughs> I landed the ship, man. Oh, I did <laughs> not change my thing I said I was doing. You know what, Luke? No, I... <laughs> Luke, I, I, I will fix it right now. I don't know why since I'm playing Dark Souls. Because you are. No, it wouldn't update my Twitch settings, I just would go live anyway. So anyway, I'm gonna fix that right now. Did this game get played last Friday? Yes. Yeah. Mac I thought Mackie's game was that played. We'll talk played. about that later. Now. They got ambushed. They managed to win with some quick thinking from Mervis actually just settling the battlefield with some missing blobs that chained them in place. But yeah, before that, me. after Duzak got his impairment fixed with his tail and the new grown is uh, a new arm is being grown for bird and a raiding of the kitchen was done they decided to leave jedi alone in, in the bridge who proceeded to press a bunch of buttons everyone is now hairless due to a antibacterial foam uh what else the ship got landed which is what allowed tear to actually bore a hole through because they were Holding on for dear life on the outside of the ship. Button. Music was turned on, some techno music. Uh, there was w one other thing, I think. I don't remember. It was, some it was something in in inconsequential. But nonetheless, a lot of shenanigans ensued. A fight with Tear happened, and you guys won. And then the session ended with... Jedi learning how to fly the ship. <laughs> the, se the session ended with Mervis and Ophelia running to the bridge of the ship. In a panic, because apparently, Lachemir had spoken to their minds and asked if they ever seen a man melt, and tear melted before their very eyes. And with the help of Mervis's guiding hand, a acorn that sprouted into a small, somewhat compass, twiggy compass, is pointing in the direction of the sea. 
And Mervis, I need you to make an intelligence check as we start this campaign off. Sorry, we start this session off. I need you to make a new campaign. Hold on. I'm so confused. Neon. We do. We, 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 we don't need that right now. We don't need that right now, please. Don't you harass me. I believe in you. This role is going to be great. It's going to. Yeah. Seven. What is well, it? 13. 13. That's an intelligence check for a total of. 13. Does anyone have anything they'd like to do to help him or stimmy that? I don't think there's anything I can do. I don't think I can help him be smarter. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I'm waiting. Do God gives an inspiring speech. Can I put on the cap of intellect? You can in this breath you're about to take. Alright, I'll attune to that over all the rest. Okay, and with that, this campaign has ended because you all lost and died. <laughs> I shit. Not at all. <laughs> so, and what? Never fought tear. Um, yeah, those were illusions. Tyr is an illusion specialist. Um, and between that and uh, I don't remember what epic level spell it was. It is a first level epic. It's a first level epic spell. Uh, I think it's called Infinity Room. Anyway, so he had upped Infinity Room and none of it was noticed because Get silence up. So, no verbal components were heard, and he can achieve somatic using his tool of power. So, essentially, you guys were put in that since you were grouped up in the bridge. He used Major Image. His tool of power also allows illusions to feel physical. They can't interact with you, but you can interact with them. That's the difference. And it's one of those things, it's wild. But basically, you guys are trapped in an infinity room, which is now permanent because it's been up for more than an hour. Yeah, we're not all he dead. Controls but... all the okay. He controls all of it in there, and Mervis got to make that check because he used divination magic to try and find a direction, i.e. a way out inadvertently. That's why I asked if anybody had anything else. I don't yeah, have anything to do. It is called an infinity room. So with that check, it was sealed. And I, I I thought about many ways I could try and get everyone out of this, and I could not come up with any <laughs> yeah, good reason. He had me up all morning, and it's like, what about Like this? three hours just bouncing off ideas, like, would this make sense? No, this doesn't make sense. <sighs> so yeah, that is... This campaign. So I told you not to look away, Luke. Ah. Uh, it's... That sucks. I keep watching. It says I have one viewer, which I assume is Luke. Thank goodness. Um, Maggie, I, I, so I'm going to... Enjoy your vacation, yeah, Maggie. I'm going to unpublish this video. <laughs> because, <laughs> but I wanted this to happen in this way because it is how we play d and and I put my partner inspiration to help us there. Because that could make somebody go mad and create a side quest. Exactly. You can have a side quest if you guys die. I, I'm sitting here, but I don't have a single thing in here. Yeah, no, once you guys take a rest, your fate is sealed. Because there's a fucked up thing you can do with Infinity Room, where basically you just make it to where nobody is. By the way, with major image working the way it does, like when Mervis thought they were taking him down and stuff like that, they weren't. It was just the space got warped an illusion of what they thought was the door opening and closing. And Major Image is a fucked up spell to begin with. It's actually super powerful. It's, it's underused. I love it. Combined with what spell, Luke? Tell me what spell you have that can solve this problem. Because you and Dylan didn't send me your character sheets. So I don't know your spells, because I trusted you guys to keep track of that, and you we're going to be here, and you didn't send me your sheets. He's going to cast... Oh, you have all our spells. He's going to cast this spell magic. 
<laughs> I thought you had. I gave you sent that. To so you. what spell, Luke? Tell me. Tell me what spell you got. It's not the spell magic. It doesn't work. I know. I know. You just pulled it off with some bullshit. <laughs> You guys are talking about doing that kind of anti magic, or are you having translocation, Luke? Guess what? You got like 50 more days for that to work. The only epic level spell you got in your disposal is Hungry Fisher, and you guys aren't on the ground. Well, no, we actually don't. Because have they didn't go back. Man, and really, didn't go back and no, we had to get burned from Tool of Power when you guys had the chance either, so that's gone. I have hideous mandate, but that's somebody I have to see, and I doubt we saw Tear. Oh no, you don't see Tear. Yeah, so they're never going to see Tear. That's the problem here. You never saw him in the ship in the first place. Virgil invisible. Can you hide in this Mobius strip? Mackie? Just turn off the stream. The Mackie make it. Turn off the stream, Mackie. Just turn off the stream. Mackie, enjoy, enjoy, enjoy your vacation. We enjoy your vacation. All right. You, you, you kind of just freaked him out right there. What, Luke? No, Mackie. Listen, just Mackie, turn off the stream. Enjoy your vacation. You have a good time. Don't think about us. Don't think about us. You're doing great. Thanks for updating us with pictures of our shit looks awesome. Oh, that's yeah, really Your vacation looks rad. Was that lake actually that blue, or was that just a bunch of flowers? Because I don't have water that looks that blue. Was it water or flowers? It is? It does? Oh, yeah. No shit. Yeah. That's anyway. Awesome. So. I, yeah, I had hope nothing. Hoping that he turned off the stream, I will go oh, into an epilogue of sorts. Um. Parts does come. Literally water. I looked at it very quickly a while ago. And I'm just like. That's water, Dylan. I looked at it very quickly, scrolling through everything, trying to see what was going on. So, anyway, Barch does come. And. That is no bird this morning. It's both consequential <laughs> and inconsequential. Came in back with the milk debt. Because this story ends at the end of the you know, at the end of time to begin with. This universe that this has existed in was already coming to a close. And whether Bart chooses to infect the last living people with what he considers joy and fun. That doesn't matter. It doesn't matter that Bart and Lachamere have a tiny argument and Lachamere is turned into a literal bunny rabbit. Bart is the only unchecked, unfettered being in this multiverse anymore. And eventually, that also comes to an end because all things do. So we'll be picking up next Friday with a new campaign that is like a steampunk western setting. It's gonna be pretty interesting. Uh, I hope everybody tunes in and that's the stream. <laughs> See you guys later. Bye. See you again.